get serious about this marijuana production enterprise, we're gonna have to think about how to set it all up. First thing is location. Any suggestions? Dude, we should totally grow chips. <laughs> no. No, let's grow cheesy puffs. There's a field in, in near my house. How about there's a fence you have to cross to get to it. You have to walk a long ways, and you can't see it from the road. It would be perfect. D describe that once more. I, I don't know if a reasonable person can consider that a private area. <laughs> there's a fence. And yeah, there's a fence. You have reasonably, to to you need to think reasonably. I'll take care of this. Oh, no way, Maddie. What about an airplane flying over the field? <laughs> it's obvious that a reasonable person can see a field of pot from an airplane. Even if that field somehow qualified as the curtilage of your home, and I highly doubt it does, by the way, because obviously you don't extend the privacy of your home into the field. If it's in plain sight, then we're screwed, so that's a no-go. A reasonable person clearly does not have a reasonable expectation of privacy in a field that is on private property surrounded by a fence a fair distance from a road. Ultimately, it would depend on whether we were exhibiting an expectation of privacy that society was prepared to accept as reasonable. So no, it's not gonna work. <laughs> okay, so what about my garage? Do, do you have garage band or guitar hero? I love that game. <laughs> Reasonably! Think like a reasonable person! First we'd have to think about the driveway. Do you have a fence, a gate, any no trespassing signs posted? No. Yeah, we'll need those, and I'm talking a tall fence. It'd be best if no one can see your driveway. I mean, after all, in order to show a reasonable expectation of privacy, you have to completely block out the public. And you can't have any mailman or anyone else like that delivering anything to you. If Girl Scouts can come to your house to try to sell you cookies, then what's to stop the police, right? Do you have Girl Scout cookies? <laughs> Most important is your garage attached to your home. No. It's, it's definitely not a reasonable option then. Right! Dude, what if they have like super amazing technology where they can like beam into your like house and like see through the walls so that they like know exactly what you're doing. I mean like, they really know. Yes. <laughs> In that case, in order to conduct a valid search under the Fourth Amendment, police would need reasonable suspicion and a warrant signed by a neutral magistrate. This is why we need to be really careful and be really reasonable in our plan to grow a lot of pot and make a substantial profit. Wow, you sound about as paranoid as Bob over here. Uh, why don't we just find a barn somewhere? Well, we would need to manifest a reasonable expectation of privacy within the interior of the barn. And it would be particularly helpful if it qualified as the curtilage of one of our homes. You see, uh, in order Where to show- Where are you getting all of this? <laughs> it's it's just, just reasonable, reasonable common sense. <laughs> Dude, can we just go camping? Yes. Let's pitch a tent. That's a reasonable idea. Sounds reasonable to me. 